Google has long been the king of web browsers, along with many other things. However, recently, I took a look at the Google Password Manager built into Chrome and was shocked. When it comes to the history of password managing and web browsers, I think of the Internet Explorer times, when storing a password inside of the web browser would be the worst idea imaginable. However, using Google Password Manager, it seems way more like LastPass, and it got me thinking. Is Google Password Manager as secure as using LastPass? Now, I'm pretty sure it's not as secure as using KeyPass, which is where I used to and still do store some passwords, especially as KeyPass is an off the internet sort of program. However, from what I can tell, Google Password Manager is as secure as possible for the convenience. I say this because in most cases, it can help log into websites directly and simply by loading them up, which is very convenient. It allows for you to do password checkup to make sure that the security is as high as possible on all of your current passwords, whatever that really means. You can even export all your passwords for use in a different service. If this is just a system to store your passwords and you are still using two-factor authentication for all of the websites in the list, then it's still fairly secure. I'm not sure if there are any cases of browser hijacking to steal password databases like they used to be, but it's a high enough risk to put a lot of people off. If the passwords are stored cloud-wise and not locally, it would probably be slightly more secure. But then again, who knows? It will need to be encrypted to allow most to feel secure. And I feel like the biggest issue about it is its lack of information. How do we know the data is safe? We have no ability to. This is fairly standard procedure for Google products. At least with LastPass, when you close your browser, it will request a new login with two-factor authentication before you can use any of the passwords. Granted, this can get a bit tedious after a while, but it's safe. The LastPass app also allows you to use passwords across different apps, which does seem quite useful, although I've never really used it myself. LastPass also has secure notes, addresses, payment cards, and bank accounts, which is all very dangerous, high security information that you would not want anyone else to know about. LastPass also has some very interesting security features for account recovery, such as allowing someone else a key for you to unlock your account. Also, along with a section on sharing passwords with people, both LastPass and Google Password Manager seem to help you make sure your password is highly detailed with numbers, uppercase, lowercase, and characters, etc. But ultimately, the passwords are only as secure as the computer they are on and the user. If your home computer has no password, then anyone with access to your machine may access your full list of passwords. And similarly, if you have stored your password anywhere else on the computer in, say, an unencrypted text file, it may be just as simple to get into the account. Two-factor authentication is important to stop this issue. But if you leave your phone laying around next to your computer, unlocked, then it could pose an equal threat. To conclude, I think that Google Password Manager could be as secure as LastPass, but due to the secrecy and unknowingness of Google products, it may just be that we'll never know until something bad happens anyway. I will post my sources in the description below, but this is my first attempt at a different style of video. So please let me know what you think in the comment section below. And as always, thanks for watching.